Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, guys, wherever you are on this beautiful world. Whenever you're watching this YouTube video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers, my name is Didi. Coming to you guys from Phuket, Thailand, in my beautiful garden, in a beautiful t shirt. I'm going to talk about a little bit news, but a lot of news about the price as well, because the price is really interesting what we see on the charts, and I'm going to show some charts with you, share them with you, that you really love, really love. So let's first jump into some news and then into the charts really short. Bam, over here. This is the first news, guys. Oh my god, I really love this news. I hope you all already saw that news, but the news is about Brazil. La 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 la. Brazil. I think they're gonna be the world championship, maybe. Uh, but also, uh, they uh, are now approving Bitcoin to be used as a payment tool. So they have proved a complete regulatory framework for crypto regulating the use of Bitcoin as payment or also as investment. So Brazil is stepping up their game after we saw already many countries stepping up the game. Also Bitcoin legal in uh, now Brazil. Now also Fidelity, uh, if it comes to investment, it's one of the world's largest financial service providers has officially started opening retail, retail Bitcoin trading accounts. So normal people like you and me now can use one of the largest financial service providers to buy Bitcoins. Also very positive. So all these positive news items contribute of course to the price uh, increasing a little bit and um, for example now also here in Thailand I was doing shopping I bought me these beautiful flip-flops with a Bitcoin logo on it these are flip-flops flip-flops with a Bitcoin logo and they are from a brand the brand is Adda yeah and they are selling them in just a huge shopping mall so yes people start to notice bitcoin more and more i think even the miami uh, mayor announced yesterday that he is still accepting bitcoin as a salary even bought bitcoins yesterday all positive news but now let's see what this news is doing to the charts over here now um, if we look at the charts guys we can see for example here on the short term bam there was a huge pump positive news pump in it the bam bam indicator already caught that really early over here we can see of course here in the bottom the bam bam crossing over there we can see the long flag over there and um, we can see the yellow declining into green dot over there and that is where the bam bam already gave along and a purple triangle um, let's say we take it very long uh, late and safe we would still be uh, in a two percent profit on the four hour chart without leverage if you for example use a leverage of 10 that would be almost a 20 percent uh, profit really good trade over there now zooming out a little bit of course to the weekly in the weekly we can see something very important this weekly candle is going to close in four days and 22 hours we had three long wicks to the bottom and we are now slowly crawling um, above again and this candle is going to be a very important candle we have a beautiful wick we have a beautiful body now let's see if we can bring that body closer to that purple line that's around 18,000 and um, this is a very good um, move in my opinion which means for example that this could be the ultimate bottom that we saw and which means that we could go from here to there a little door and slowly work up again to that line over here and then maybe get back and bam maybe we go then to the 200 weekly moving average that will probably be, be going like this something like this is in the charts guys and that's very positive because that would mean that the bottom is in but i'm going to show you some really cool charts that shows you this way better now this chart over here i think is a very important chart and um, why is this a very important chart? because when it comes to buying bitcoin or any other asset of tr or traded um, the important part is to always look at the risk and reward ratio now as you can see i drew up this chart in the top over here this these moments are the high risk moments you won't be buying over here this is the moment you need to sell and if you see that we had a top and that this is a high risk and we crash 87 percent like you see here in the bottom sorry here in the bottom then you know that you're getting near the bottom and that there is a low risk of buying Bitcoin. So these areas are low risk Bitcoin areas to buy. High risk, you crash 84%, that's a low risk area to buy. You have a huge risk over here, but when you crash, crash 77%, almost 80%, you have a low risk in buying Bitcoins. That is how you need to look at the chart. There is always a moment that you should be selling if you didn't sell 
and the market crashes with 70 or 80 percent you know that the risk to buy Bitcoin then is very low because then there is a huge potential upwards because we already crashed with 78 percent so there is a low risk and a huge potential and that is the moment when you buy now I'm going to share a few more charts with you why I think there is a low risk moment at the moment um, and that is the first one is over the first one's over here bam this one now this um, chart shows you something really interesting I'll put my face beautiful here um, in this chart you can see the halving progress and every time when we have a halving progress of 64% we saw the bottom 64% the bottom was in now again we are exactly at 64% so it leaves us another 36% till the halving and we're talking time but if you look to the past and every time when we came around that 64% that was or the bottom was in or we were near the bottom or at this moment you tell me is the bottom in or are we near the bottom again telling me the risk of buying Bitcoin now is very low go to the next one bam over here this is the Bitcoin MVRV Z score just check it every time when that score gets here in the bottom below that line that's the moment you should be buying bitcoins in these green boxes look again here in that bottom down below that line that's the moment you should have been buying bitcoin because you would have then joined that huge bull run afterwards again in this box over there you should have been buying bitcoin because that was the bottom you would have a massive bull run from 3k to 60k and now again where are we in the bottom we are down below that line this is the moment you accumulate bitcoin another signal that there will be a reversal of the market and this is the perfect moment to be buying bitcoins every time again and again and again now another bam chart over here this one i found on stock money lizards the smma 150 every time when you see these areas over there look that bright blue and red these are the moments you should be buying Bitcoin because we are down here we are at that thick line every time here you come to it you should be buying here you see at that line here again at that line and red and bluish check what we see now we are down below that line even that's the lowest we have ever been in the RSI and there is a shitload of light blue and red so you should be buying Bitcoin and then we have a last chart guys over here this one i really like that one as well and um, on this chart you can see exactly the same uh, here on this chart it shows you the bitcoin channel momentum oscillator now every time when we are near the bottom or we had the bottom that oscillator is peaking over there you should be buying because there is a bull market after here again bottom that one is peaking you should be buying bull market comes after here we are the bottom Speaking, you should be buying because the bull market comes after once and more here again look we are peaking we are peaking we are in the peaking area you should be buying because a bull run will come after and yes that can take till 2025 but these moments that we can see over there are the moments to step into Bitcoin in a cheap way so that is what I have to say about the chart and everything today. I'm going to go and walk my 10,000 steps today on my beautiful Bitcoin flip-flops because I need to train and walk and eat healthy and all that stuff to get a little bit more physical fit again. Um, I hope you really enjoyed this video. If you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up. Share with your friends and family. Subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell. Leave a comment. What do you think about Brazil? What do you think about the Miami mayor? What do you think about Fidelity? What do you think about the charts? What do you think about my new flip-flops? What do you think about Bitcoin and everything all over the world? Thank you for watching and see you tomorrow again. Bam!